name is Brian Hotfee. I'm the executive director of Wayburn Youth Center. Well, the Youth Center is 25 years old this year. Uh, it started with a group of adults that felt that there was a need to be able to get the kids involved and uh, give them somewhere safe to hang out instead of just wandering the streets and things that way. So that's what why it started and then the whole concept of the youth center is that it is to provide the youth of Weyburn and area a safe place to hang out where we have adult volunteers we uh, we don't allow kids to come in that are uh, drunk or high on drugs uh, we do our best to keep the bullying out of the whole thing uh, we have a drop-in center here we partner with the high school and we do a program there for the boys, grade 7 to grade 12, where it's a leadership and a mentorship course. And then we also do our skateboard park, and that's skateboard and BMX and scooters and all those good, wonderful things that the kids enjoy. I tell people we're a nonprofit organization in every sense of the word. Uh, we, we raise all our own money to keep this place open. I raise the money for it, as well as my own salary. My staff raise their own salary as well. Uh, so it's a big thing to be able to get outside help with funding and the funds that we get from Communathon go directly into our programming. So without those, we wouldn't be able to do what we do. And uh, I think it's pretty crucial in a community like this to have a youth center. So. Is there anything you'd like to say to people thinking about donating this year or people who have donated in the past? Well, I always say thank you. Uh, and it isn't just a thank you, it is honestly heartfelt. Uh, we get very little money from grants, uh, and therefore uh, every penny that we get helps in a huge way. Uh, yeah, I, just, I can't help but say thank you, it's huge. I've been here, as I said earlier to you, Tara, uh, 17 years, and to me it is amazing how the community has come on to support us, uh, through Communathon, we also do a great big fundraiser in the spring, uh, fundraising banquet auction, uh, silent auction, that kind of stuff. And the community supports us, and we can't do it without you, so I say thanks.